really, my hot button is not necessarily about thieves themselves, but about the mentality that leads to stealing, cheating, and basically expecting something for nothing. Now, here's my disclaimer. This is not a political discussion, I promise you. You can't nail me as being Democrat or Republican, okay? Now, my mom drove this concept into my head. Work hard, achieve success. Nothing comes easily. But the process and the ultimate goals can make you happy because you have purpose in your life, okay? Now, here's what I think is the problem. Lately, young people get another message that successful people are somehow selfish, greedy, cheating the system. They need to be taxed more. They need to spread the wealth. They need to take care of the rest. They do not deserve what they have, and everyone should benefit. Now, remember, this is not a political discussion. I promise you that. Right now, stats, you can't argue with them, show 48% of all wage earners pay zero federal taxes. And some get checks back in a kind of reverse welfare system. Nothing paid in, but money comes back from the federal government. Now, this philosophical discussion is that there's a pervasive feeling nowadays that someone owes us something. I believe that we should take care of the less fortunate. Everyone, who doesn't believe that? But there is a limit. Here's something that might shock you. No matter what we do as a society, there will never be total equality in achievement, in success, in seized opportunities, in possessions. There will never be total equality in intelligence, in income, in life. We all have the same opportunity, or we should. What we do with it comes from here. If someone else has an iPad, more power to them. If they live in a big home, you should teach your children that's a good thing, good for them. If they have nice clothes, great. It does not belong to us. If you talk to thieves and criminals, I guarantee you they justify their actions. I've talked to them before. I've talked to people who cheat consumers. And they believe that they somehow deserve what they have stolen. The people who they steal from deserve that treatment. They believe they got shafted by society and they're stealing to balance the scales. It's a sad message. Teach your kids that they need to take responsibility for themselves and successful people are not keeping them down. No one owes them anything. The Constitution guarantees rights not things. And some people have used their rights to fail. So my purple people meter question, I didn't give it to you, Jen, did I? The purple people meter question is,